Let's talk tropical weather now. Video posted to social media shows the extent of flooding in South Florida, and it's not over yet. The remnants of what was Hurricane Agatha when it was in the Pacific became Hurricane uh, or Tropical Storm uh, Alex as it moved uh, into uh, toward uh, Florida. Now the uh, storm is over the Atlantic Basin now, and it's still going to be uh, dumping lots of heavy rain, causing problems as well as the storm is out over the Atlantic. So let's bring in meteor meteorologist Maria Ruiz now, who is tracking what is now Alex. Yeah, that was Agatha whenever it made landfall at near Oaxaca, Mexico. That circulation eventually went over areas of the southeastern Gulf, and it was still technically not named whenever it arrived in Florida. It is now Tropical Storm Alex. It's uh, located about 140 miles to the north and west of Bermuda, and a Tropical Storm Force winds expected on the island this afternoon, but that's really about it in terms of any potential impact. It's just going to continue its trek over the Atlantic over the next several days. I want to show you here the blue line indicating the path of what eventually became Alex. It was considered potential tropical cyclone one at the time that it made its way across Florida. Now it did not exactly bring tropical storm force winds the entire time it was going through Florida, but it did bring in some heavy rain and you saw the flooding there. Big drainage issues across portions of Miami whenever uh, what was eventually Alex went through, but anywhere between five to about nine inches of rain reported. It's not also taken into consideration the storm surge or water that gets pushed onto shore uh, because of a tropical system. Oh, yes, we are expecting an above average as uh, uh, Atlantic hurricane season here for the 2022 season. So that's something that we'll be watching, of course, and we'll keep you updated. But as of now, this is not going to impact any U.S. land. It's just going to continue to move into the middle of the Atlantic. Back to you.